allegedly, Google has bought um, the website address navigator.com. One word dot com. Right. One word dot com would go for a million pounds right, at the moment. Right. Plenty of examples in Name Bio and DN Journal where that's the case. You can see them sold for that, that sort of price. Brokered. Right? Usually brokered for that price. Um, so, if you were a, a seller of a OneWord.com and, and you knew that Google was the buyer, e.g. a company worth a tri- about 1.5 1, 1. plus trillion plus, whatever it is, you wouldn't sell it cheap, would you? So it's almost certainly gone for a million pound plus. If the buyer knew that Google was the buyer, if the seller knew that Google was the buyer, I'd have thought. I don't think it would have sold for less than that. Um, this is the main name for you. Apple have gone and bought a website address to do with hiking and trekking. The combination of two words as a website address and dot com. I don't know what they're going to do with that. I don't know what Google's going to do with navigator.com. Um, and there's also an interview that um, the person that founded the ring.com web brand, or the doorbell, ring doorbell, he talks about how he founded that company and why he founded it and how much they pay, well not how much they pay, but um, a good idea of how much they pay. Well, well above $200,000 for the web address ring.com and then Amazon went and bought it for a billion pounds or something, something like that or whatever it was but it's good hearing from the, the founder of the company that Amazon bought it from why he invented the company and that's it that ring.com now is ring.com it's just like ring doorbells everyone knows what they are but back in the day they didn't I think it was 2011 when it was founded good, inter- good interview to listen to that but you get to know these in, these uh these things if you're into domain names and obviously I buy domain names so I get to know who buys what when and how much and all that all good fun adios